Hi everyone, welcome back to Calm and Kinky. I'm here to do an update video on two products that I recently reviewed and I said the verdict was out for me, but that I would try it a third time to see if I liked it. The products I'm referring to are the ELF HD Mattifying Cream Foundations. They're also labeled as oil-free. Here's the packaging. I have them in two colors, and I won't go into too much detail in this video about the colors and all that because I have a video already showing these products. So this is merely going to be an update, but I will link that video either here somewhere on the screen or below, okay? So tonight was the night that I decided to try the product again. So I've had the product on my face for probably about an hour now. And I said, okay, I'm gonna try it, but this time I'm gonna use a lighter hand. So what I did was I still use the same process as last time. I used the lighter color first and then I layered the darker color on top. And what I did was I just dabbed it in the major areas of my face. So I probably took each color and just put it here, 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 you know, cheeks, a little bit on the nose and the chin. And I buffed it in using um, one of my flat brushes that is too far for me to go get, but a flat brush. Brushed it in, um, buffed it in, excuse me, and then I layered the other one on top using the same methodology, and I think it worked out better this time. I did also use a primer. I used the e.l.f. primer. If you like these type of videos, go ahead and like this video so I know to bring you more content like this. And while you're at it, go ahead and subscribe. I also did um, put some... What is it called? Concealer. I also put some concealer on some of my hyperpigmentation spots before putting the product on. The only thing that I did not do this time that I did last time was that I did not set my face with the Urban Decay D Slick um, setting spray. So all I did was use the product, went ahead and did my blush, my bronzer, contoured, all of that stuff, and then I set it with my Neutrogena setting powder, and that was it. I'm not sure if I'm going to actually spray my face or not. I kind of want to spray it because I'm going out and I, I liked having a very matte finish the entire night. However, I feel like these products may be best used not with a setting spray. I think because they're already oil free and they have, they go on very creamy, but they dry like very matte. I think maybe using this product along with the setting powder, and then on top of that, putting a setting spray, maybe too much for my skin. And that may be why I didn't like it before. It was settling in my pores weird. I felt like it was giving me dry patches in certain areas, so I really did not like it. And this is the third time of me trying it, and I actually like it tonight. We'll see how I look a couple hours from now after I get back from, you know, where I'm going tonight, and we'll see if I still liked it. But so far, so good. If you guys can see, it's not... It's not settling in my pores bad. Unfortunately, it's nighttime, so I don't have any natural lighting to give you guys the same type of view I gave you in the last video. But you probably can just pick up on the fact that my skin does look very smooth. It looks hydrated, doesn't look dry, and it's not settling in any of my large pores awkwardly like I thought it was last time. And so far, I don't have any dry patches either that I've noticed. Okay, so... Third time, third time may be a charm. I actually like the way the product looks so far. What I'll do is either insert a little note at the end of this video or I'll come back on camera after I've worn this product all night and let you guys know how it held up. I'll also let you know if I decided to use the spray or if I didn't use the spray. I don't know, I'm so tempted to use the spray just because I want my face to last all night, but I don't wanna mess it up and make it too dry. So. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'll let you guys know what happens. Thank you guys for watching this video. The link to the other video will be below. Until next time, peace, love, and prosperity. Bye. Okay, so I did decide to use the Urban Decay Setting Spray. It actually worked out really well. Bye. So definitely check this product out and go ahead and subscribe now. Bye.